We as humans are very well addicted to newness. And newness is something that a lot of people really don't understand that much and why it kind of sucks up a lot of entrepreneurs and myself. Newness is the habit of always having to see new shit, buy new shit, like basically put yourself in front of a new environment consistently. Either that's by moving, like buying a new watch, buying a new car, buying something new that makes you feel like you're completely new. And that's like a very expensive habit, but also it's a very undisclosed power that most people will never exploit. Because when people think of newness, they think of buying shit, they think of expenses, but it's different for me. You know, if I wanna buy something new, obviously I'm taking on that financial obligation. I need to be able to go harder. Most people will buy shit and think about how they just have to save money to make up for it. For me, it's like, I gotta make up for it, so I gotta go 10 times harder. Say 10X if you, if you know what I'm talking about. And that's how you become more successful. It's that switch in the mindset that really separates like the average ass people from the winners. So the next time you wanna buy something new, you wanna get into the whole newness addiction, just understand that you should not be looking at it as an expense, look at it as an undisclosed superpower, okay? The 1% is the 1% for a reason. We exploit things that we know others will think of as average, but we make them extraordinary. And that's why we win. You have to start changing the way you think, start changing the way you look at situations. I learned most of that from just self-awareness, living in New York, dealing with just hustlers and, and just people who are just honestly a bunch of assholes. Like when you're dealing with a bunch of assholes, you learn a lot. So yeah, I mean, that's the name of the game. Stop looking at it as an expense superpower. If you can exploit newness, whoo -hoo -hoo.